In this video, we are still going to look at sequences, the general term, but we are going to focus on geometrical progressions. You will find this on page 49 in the Namibia AS level mathematics textbook y equals mx plus c to success. The general term of a geometrical progression. If, in, if general we can write a, a geometrical sequence like this. So in general we can write a geometrical sequence like this. So a, ar, ar squared, ar to the power of 3. Where a is the first term, r is the factor between the terms, the common ratio. Note, r should not be 0, otherwise these terms will disappear. The formula to find the general term Tn of a geometric progression is Tn equals ar to the power n minus 1. We use n minus 1 because r is not used in the first term. That's why, because it starts at the second term, we say second minus 1 to get that 1. Okay, but let's look at an example. Determine the 7th and the 10th term of the GP, and this is the GP. It seems to me just, there's a printing, there should have been a 12. Okay, so if I start, it's a GP, so to get that value of R, I can just take T2 divide by T1, so it's negative 4 divide 12, and it's negative 4, and A is 12. And then I basically just substitute, and I get my answer. The same here, just substitute and get your answer. Now, let's look at exam, um, try now 9. I want you to stop the video, and I want you to do C. You can continue the video as soon as you are finished. Okay, let's start. Number C. I always first like to write down everything. There is your terms. And they tell you it's a GP. So you must memorize the formulas. So this is term 1, term 2, term 3. So if we start and I say find the fifth term. Now first before we do that, just say to, um, to T2 minus T1 will give you the value of R. Okay, now not minus, just divide. Okay, so that will be one third divide one, which is very nice because then it's just one third. And the value of A is one, it's actually a nice one. So T5, if I want to find T5, it's A, okay, let me write it down here, uh, the general term. The general term, I just want to write it here, is Tn equals A or N minus 1. So I can just substitute then, then A is 1, or let's just see what is the value of R, there is R, a third, and then it's 5 minus 1. And that will be 1 third to the power of 4. And that will give you a final answer of 1 over 81. And then T13. And exactly the same, 1. But now it's 1 third and it's 13 minus 1. So it's 1. One third to the power of two, and that answer will then be oh, it's a bit big. One over just press one to the power of twelve stays one, but three to the power of twelve it's five, three, one, four, four, one. You can just press that on your calculator, and that's how you do it.